Hi Capricorn, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Capricorn, please do remember <clears throat> to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Capricorn. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the um, Judgment card, and this is Scorpio energy. So this is an energy of someone who wants to change a situation. They want to transform a situation. They also feel they've done some inner work. This can be someone who's done some sort of shadow work, and they've achieved a breakthrough, and they feel like they're more ready now to pursue a connection here, because this can also show someone who wants a second chance, or they want your acceptance, your approval, your validation in some way. So let's see what the rest of the cards have to say. Okay, we have the Page of Swords, Air Energy, the Page of Pentacles, Earth Energy, and the Ten of Swords in the Reverse, Air Energy. So this person has done a lot of healing work with the Ten of Swords. They also feel ready now. They are ready to, um, you know, pick themselves up from some sort of painful situation. It could be an ending or betrayal, but this person wants to try again. Um, they feel like they have more to offer this time around, and... Again, with the Page of Pentacles, they want to present you with an opportunity. You know, this is someone who's willing to go the extra mile. They feel more capable now and they, they're able to invest more. This person has been thinking a lot about you with that Page of Swords energy. They're thinking about what you're up to. They're very curious about you. And um, it's like they are watching you or wanting to check in on you, asking friends about you, getting readings on you, checking your social media. But there's just this energy of you know, wanting to find out about you because they are trying to come towards you. They're planning to come towards you and they want to know, um, you know, if it's a good time or, you know, there's this energy of wanting to be sure before making a move. So let's clarify these cards, Capricorn. bottom of the deck we have the page and um, the knight of pentacles earth energy so this is a slow moving energy this is an energy of someone who is coming your way they may be traveling towards you but they are coming towards you with this this offer this confession this truth this this um intention of committing to something you know being serious this time so let's see we have the justice card libra energy Ace of Pentacles, Earth Energy, and the Three of Swords, Air Energy. So this is definitely someone who you could have experienced some sort of a heartbreak. Um, there could have been a third party situation as well. Um, this person could have um, felt betrayed in some way with that Three of Swords being there. Or you could have felt betrayed, but there's this energy of both people having had their heart broken in the situation. 
and it's like this person if there was a third party they regret including that third party because it only led to them getting their heart broken um and it's like now they 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 they've been working through that they they feel like they've healed from that and they want to come your way they want to initiate something with you with the ace of pentacles they want to do right by you they want some sort of fairness equal give and take with the justice card there as well and they, they want to be in a partnership with you and they're making that offer to you and they, this is someone who is intending to really back up their words with actions okay so i'm going to pull out an oracle card for you um capricorn So the card says, luck is on your side. New moon in Sagittarius. So this person is feeling quite optimistic to come towards you. Um, this this energy of them also being uh, blunt or honest with you. They're going to be upfront. They're going to speak their truth and be direct. Okay, so I'm going to pull out another card for you, Capricorn. have engagements your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment so this person wants to commit this time this person wants to be serious this time um they want they're coming towards you with these you know long-term intentions okay so i'm going to pull out another card for you capricorn So the card says, dangerous pleasure. The secret to reaping the greatest fruitfulness and the greatest enjoyment from life is to live dangerously. Okay, so this person is really, it's like they're taking a leap of faith towards you. We also have this Sagittarius energy. Um, they are, you know, taking that chance here. Yeah, this is someone who is hoping that you will be open to hearing them or, you know, even more in this energy of being willing to look past the three of swords. So whatever this heartbreak was, um, they're hoping that you can forgive it. Um, but there is this energy of this person. It's, it's like they're feeling optimistic, but at the same time, it, it's more so them feeling like they have to be optimistic because there is a chance here that, you know, they're taking quite a big leap of faith. Okay, so I'm going to pull out some messages from your person, um, Capricorn. So the first card says, you came closer than anyone. It's time for me to heal now. I want to feel that way again. So this person wants a second chance. This person, they, they've done some sort of shadow work. They have really had to heal from something because we do have the Ten of Swords in the reverse and they, they feel like they are ready to try to get back to that place again with you, to experience those feelings again with you. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Capricorn. 
I hope you have a really, really good day, Capricorn. Bye, Capricorn.